Next one we're going to cover is Pudilova versus Perez. Yeah, Eileen Perez, man. She's taking the uh, the internet by storm with her wins, dude. <laughs> <laughs> Yo. We, look, this fight wasn't even that great, but we have to talk about it just because of the, just the before and after. If you look here, you can't really see it, but under uh, Eileen's eye, she's the one on the right, under her eye was like already swollen. Yeah. I guess, she, uh, hey, shout out Tony, Sundays with the boys. Hey. Um, uh, allegedly, there's conflicting stories on this, but allegedly at the PI uh, a couple days ago, maybe it was yesterday or the day before, uh, Jocelyn Edwards, UFC fighter, cracked her a little too hard. Uh, and that's what gave her the shiner. And there was a scuffle, allegedly. And uh, Eileen's coach ran in there, fucking threw on that rear naked choke on Jocelyn Edwards, tried to choke her out for going too hard at Eileen Perez. They had to be separated. It was this whole whole deal of, drama uh, him, a, him a, a coach attacked another fighter a female fighter uh for a lot of drama going on in las vegas this weekend don't even talk to me about that um <laughs> but you know so there's drama before the fight fight happens eileen takes her down really good takedowns in the first two rounds you know grinds her out mounts her doesn't really do too much second round pudilova comes back um H.W. Comer says Will's tag is missing again. I think it's just covered by the banner, the Eileen Perez versus uh, Lucy uh, Pudilova banner. Oh, is that what um, it is? I think it's just underneath. Yeah, probably. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> but good comeback from Pudilova, right, in the third round. Uh, ends up taking her back. You know, she's stopping the takedowns now. Takes her back. Almost rear naked chokes her. Almost gets the finish. Doesn't quite. So pretty easy 29-28 for Eileen Perez. Eileen then proceeds to do what she does every time she wins and start twerking. And then the broadcast cuts from. I'm not going to show it because it's like, but it was hilarious. If you have, if you didn't see it, definitely go watch it because it cuts from her twerking to her like seven year old child in the crowd who's like smiling, and then you see his face just like, oh, she's twerking again, and like look down, and then it cuts back to her twerking, and it's just like, uh, what the fuck? The and then she wishes him a happy what birthday. You, yeah, you're like, what are you doing? The and then she proceeds to twerk again up against the fence. <laughs> Up against the fence. And we have a picture of that. Her and her coach go up against the fence to twerk right in front of the commentary booth. And Brennan Fitzgerald lights up. He's like, the best she in the house. He like throws his arm up. <laughs> hilarious. <laughs> what hilarious. is going on? Which is why the fight wasn't great. But, you know, might as well cover it because it's fucking hilarious. The hilarious fact that talk about. right after this, Brennan Fitzgerald. Yeah. Can't guess this. Was that Brennan Fitzgerald fist pumping right in front of her? Yeah, that's him right there with the light blue uh shirt and the tie uh in the background and right after this he's like the best she in the house and he fucking puts his arm up hilarious <laughs> dude <laughs> oh my god man classic all right yeah. man uh <laughs> you know props to eileen perez um and win, hopefully could... you know she continues winning and maybe she doesn't take her son to the fights to watch the uh post-fight celebrations you know but yeah she uh she called out uh, norma dumont she said the battle of the asses it's like, God damn, dude, this girl's crazy. <laughs> <laughs> Hilarious. Oh, you know man. Fitzgerald will be there for that one. All right. Yeah, dude. I don't even, had, I'm not even in the booth, but I'll be there front row. <laughs> <laughs>